Seoul, June 1, 2023, the South Korean Defense Ministry announced a successful interception test of the long-range surface-to-air missile, ELSAM, marking its third success out of four attempts. The ELSAM interceptor was launched on May 30, 2023, from the Anhum testing site of the Agency for Defense Development in Tian, 109 km southwest of Seoul, according to reports from the South Korean press agency Yonhap News. The ELSAM, a key homegrown missile interceptor currently under development, is a part of South Korea's vigorous efforts to deter evolving North Korean threats. It is being developed by Hanwat and LIG Next One, two of South Korea's leading defense companies. The interceptor is designed to target and destroy ballistic missiles from North Korea during their terminal phase, using a trailer-mounted S-band active electronically scanned array AESA, radar. As an upper-tier interceptor, ELSAM is a crucial part of the Korean Air and Missile Defense KAMD, project, a layered defense system slated to be operational in the early 2020s. This system also includes the lower-tier Patriot PAC-3 and KMSAM batteries. The ELSAM system is touted as having performance levels twice superior to the Patriot and KMSAM missiles. Its design features a hot launch type vertical launching system, VLS, contrasting with the KMSAM, which uses a cold launch type VLS developed in Russia. The ELSAM system is expected to comprise two types of interceptors, one for aircraft and the other for ballistic missiles. These missile interceptors will be capable of intercepting missiles at altitudes between 40 to 100 kilometers. A typical ELSAM battery will include a multifunction radar, a command and control C2, center, a combat control station, and four truck-mounted launchers, with two designated for each missile type. The first successful test firing of the ELSAM interceptor took place on February 23, 2022, to verify its ability to fly on an intended trajectory and hit a preset target accurately. With this latest successful test, South Korea continues to make significant strides in developing a robust missile defense system in response to the potential North Korean threats.